Hi, you guys. We're here with this beautiful woman, Pink. Thank you. Uh, Pink passion. Pink passion. That's, That's what right. I mean. Tell me a little about you because I had so much, so much personality, so much, such good vibes. Such energy, right? Yes, I'm telling you, it. girl, that's the way to go. Life is too short. <laughs> yes. You got to put your best foot forward. And nowadays I say you got to put everything you have forward because energy is life. Let yeah. me tell you, it is. The energy that you give is the energy that people take on and they project. So um, I'd like to give all I got. Shall I say? Nice. <laughs> and what do you what do you do for a living? Well, for a living, um, for a living, I'm actually a nurse. Oh wow! Oh, I'm a nurse so um, here giver. in Las Vegas, and I am a giver, yep. and I'm a caregiver. That oh. is, so I can give, but I can also care for you too, and that's important. Mm -hmm. But I, my passion is, um, I'm a host. I'm a radio personality here in Las Vegas um, for 22.3, Take Over Vegas Radio. And I'm also a TV host for um, the Dolls and Queens DQ Surgery Bar, um, which we're getting ready to actually rename to the Kayla Cummings Dolls and Queens DQ Surgery Bar. And we're going to revamp it, and it's going to be coming with new episodes and new material this fall, and I'm super excited. Nice. So um, I have all those projects on through my belt, and um, I'm so happy to be here tonight, you know, to be yeah. with you, to have met all these beautiful, wonderful people, and yeah. the opportunities that are here tonight. I mean, it's so many, like, tribute artists and celebrities here. I'm looking to network with everyone and, um, you know, share my platforms with everyone and hopefully they'll be willing to inspire. share their stuff with me and of course inspire yes Thank you yes yes <laughs> she doesn't even i tell you the energy in this room guys is just amazing it's phenomenal so um yes thank you so much thank for having you. me thank you for coming and i hope we stay in touch i'm gonna i'm gonna exchange absolutely yes always i want to support you and see the show especially so the show you guys tell us a little bit about the show before okay well before you go okay really quick guys let me tell you so um the 22.3 pink passion show it airs every thursday at 3 p.m pacific standard time and 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm telling you, I'm a walking billboard because I say this over and over when I meet people. Good. So I have it like Perfect. down pat in my head. Guys, this is not scripted. <laughs> this is just what I know to tell everybody. You know what I mean? Yeah. And um, it's because you're consistent. That's what I'm I consistent. Mean. Right. Exactly. So on the fashion show, um, we actually I have interviews with businesses any type of celebrities, everybody, um, they come on and they help our system with marketing their business or their trade or their craft. They talk about that. I give them a window, say eight to 10 minutes, um, because my show is just an hour and I have a panel of passion callers, you know, people that listen to me that I have to also dedicate part of my show to. So, um, we talk about sex now, sex in a great way. It's also educational. But we do it in a fun way. And what I mean by that is, for example, one of my shows was called um, The Zoo. The and zoo. we called it The Zoo. And it was basically like, what does your partner act like versus sound like? So he could sound like a tiger and act like a little chipmunk or a squirrel girl. So we <laughs> talked about we talked about that. <laughs> yes. You got to you gotta listen to the show, guys, because I give them very catchy titles. You know what I mean? So then I had a show on there we called, um, I called one The Wishing Well. And that was about, you know, how deep sex is when, when things are, <laughs> the garage goes into the car, shall we say. <laughs> the Wishing Well. <laughs> So, I mean, it is crazy. The show is crazy. Oh, I bet. And this past week, we had um, part one was of, um, oh, what was it called this week? I forgot what it's called. Yeah. I drew a blank. But anyway, those are some examples of what we talk about. So, it's educational as well. You know. And entertaining um, for and sure. And entertaining for sure. for sure. And then on the Kayla Cummings, the new Kayla Cummings Styles of Queens 
surgery bar talk show is the one yeah we're gonna talk about um body enhancements not only body enhancements this year but what is fabulous fabulosity is fabulous so <laughs> yes girl it's not just fabulous it's fabulosity is fabulous so if you're a fabulosity type of a gal or a guy what makes you fabulous? I'm breaking it down. Yeah, break it down for me. Oh, please. yes. I'm breaking it down. <laughs> I love it. Prime example is, I tell everybody, like Nestle. Nestle makes this great chocolate chip cookie, right? Right. But their story behind it might be that when they started, they started off with generic morsels or chocolate chips that were imitation or something. But people liked it. And that made them fabulous. So they stuck with it. So I want to know in the heart of you, you're from, you have fabulosity about yourself. Do you agree? Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Do you agree? You got to have that confidence. <laughs> so then what makes you, so what makes you fabulous? You see what I mean? Mm. So that's the concept. You know what I mean? So we're going to dip into that, and we're also going to dip into body enhancements. So I'm getting ready to do something that no one's ever done before on talk show TV. And um, I know it's going to be aired on a channel. So that's the goal, and I know it's going to happen. I'm claiming it because I'm getting ready to do something that no one other talk show is out there doing. But you guys got to watch your scene. Body enhancement one? Yeah, that's, I don't think oh, it's, it's, it's getting ready to be killer. If mentally, if you feel that you want to look different or you want to enhance something, I encourage you to do it. Because, hey, I do it. I don't worry about it. You don't need to do it. I do whatever I want to do. Did you need to? You got your lipstick? I got my lipstick. I sure do. Are you sure? I sure do. Puck it up. Nose is natural. Your nose is good. My nose is natural. But I've done other body enhancements and if you go on my youtube channel um, you talk about dolls it? and queen surgery bar there's a clip on there that tells you when i first got started and it'll it's called my first encounter under the knife so if you go on um youtube go under dolls and queen surgery bar just google that and bring up that queen show surgery bar. dolls and queen surgery bar and that's with the z and dolls is d-o-l-l-z and queens is q-u-e-e-n-z Z. Surgery bar. Uh -huh. And if you look on the videos and see my first encounter under the knife, that's my personal story where I got started in the plastic world. But it's addictive, though, I find. It's addictive because you become, it's mental. Right. You feel, oh, gosh, I could get this better. Or I could do this better. But it's almost like an addiction to anything. Alcohol, drugs, sex. You got to have a balance. And you have to know when to stop. And it can be... Too much. Right. You know. I like that you kept it natural. Like, it's not, I would have never known you guys would have down and done that. Yeah. So, so, you know when you're, when to stop. That's but I'm telling you, if you catch me on a different day, sometimes I'm like, give it all to me. I don't care. <laughs> so, it just depends. <laughs> you know, you wake up in the morning and you're like, what do I feel like today? What color am I going to wear today? So, it's kind of like, okay, who do I want to be today? Yeah. So, that's what I do, girl. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I love her. Yes. So the Instagram. What is your what is your Instagram? Your other social that people get to follow. Okay. You well, follow. if you um to follow me, it's dolls, D-O-L-L-Z, in the letter N, Q U E E N C Surgery Bar. That's my IG account. It is, but that's my title, Dolls and Queen Surgery Bar. And then the other, once you get on that platform, you, see the you can see fashion. the other um, links for the YouTube channel and for my other pages, and you can go from there. But the Dolls and Queen Surgery Bar is my main page, my platform there. You'll and you'll see some me. clips. Okay, sounds good. Thank you. You'll have a great time. Don't worry. I'm very interested. I have, um, <laughs> and I'm getting ready to be in another magazine, um, actually, in a couple months. Um, Phoenix Voyage Magazine has already reached out to me. And I was featured in their magazine last year. I've been featured in Las Vegas Pride. I've been featured in um, a couple magazines. So you'll see all of that there, too. Mm. So I'm up and coming, girl. Yeah. It ain't stopping. I can tell. We're going to continue working hard. Tell you guys, work hard, dedication, consistency. And it's not even sometimes about working hard. It's just consistency. And consistency brings working hard. Because you find yourself doing it day in and day out. And next thing you know, you're working hard. But if you don't think about working hard and just be consistent at what you do, you'll reach it. 
and not even realize you're working hard. Yeah, and be disciplined though, because working hard you gotta have some type of. But you can't put working hard in your mind. That's my whole thing. Just be consistent, passionate about what you do. If it's something that you like to do out there, you be passionate about it. You do it consistently, and that leads to working hard. And it'll you won't even think about it. You won't even think about it. Two years later, you're famous. You, you got this, baby. <laughs> All right. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you for the opportunity. Thank you. And we'll see you soon. <laughs>